dam holding the city's supplies remains low despite the heavy rains. Caroline B tells us why we should expect the rationing to go on. The Ndakaini Dam in Muranga County is the lifeline of Nairobi. Water used in the city is drawn from this reservoir, which has existed for close to 22 years. Despite the heavy rains pounding several parts of Kenya, there is a crippling water shortage in the city and low water levels at the Ndakaini Dam, which draws its water from the Abadea. But unfortunately, as you can see today, it is sunny here, so it is not raining much in the Abadeas. So the rivers from the Abadeas don't have a lot of water as they should. A lot of rains have been experienced in Nairobi and the Rift Valley region and also other parts of the country, but that cannot be said of the Abadea region, which is the main catchment area of the Ndakaini Dam. And therefore, Nairobi residents should expect the water rationing to continue since the water levels here at the Ndakaini Dam are really, really low. That is until the water levels and also the rains improve in the coming months. In March 2017, Ndakaini Dam went to the lowest at 21%. After minimal rains in July, the volume rose to 37% and was recharged further to 52% by end of December last year. However, the drought experienced since January affected the water levels and as of 16th April 2018, the Ndakaini Dam was holding only 31.4% of water. We are taking advantage of the Chania River to supply the water so that we save the water in the dam for the dry period. So that is why we are not releasing a lot of water to Nairobi. The little that we are getting, we are saving it and just releasing very little. The water supply in Nairobi has also been challenged since the Nairobi Water and Sewerage Company extends its supply to towns such as Kiambu, Juja and Arthur River among others. The low levels of storage available is also caused by leakages due to old infrastructure. But the company says it will reinforce the Ndakaini supply through the construction of an additional dam. You have the northern collector system. Uh, we are building next to us here a treatment plant. We are building a tunnel and whole uh, waterworks going all the way to Nairobi. They will be producing, after the works are completed in December 2019, the system will be producing 140,000 additional meters cubed per day. The low levels in Dakaini simply means the residents of Nairobi should expect the water rationing to continue up until the water volume in the dam improves. Caroline B, KTN News.